Hey now, everybody! Guess who it is? Sodoron! I'm back. I'm back from the dead! Right? Like, I've had people say, Hey, Sodoron, you haven't put anything up for six months, so you're a dead channel. I'm not dead. I'm alive! Here I am. So I'm back, stream. Uh, I'm back, ready, better than ever, to start streaming League of Legends again. Now here's what happens, it was 11.30 at night tonight, and I was laying in bed with my cute little dog in there, JD, which stands for Just Dog, or whatever else you want to make up for it, uh, Jack Daniels, Johnny Depp, I don't know, Just Dog, JD, anyways, my little sidekick in there. We couldn't sleep, so I figured, you know what? I'm going to get up out of bed and play a game of League of Legends and start streaming and see what happens. So, what have I been doing, guys? Well, I have been working on a lot of stuff here. I've got, like, notebooks and notebooks full of notes where I constantly watch LPL every single day and LCK and then maybe some LEC, but I haven't had time right now to even watch last week's LEC because the LPL is so good right now. Um, I've been the LCK fanboy the whole time and I'm getting more and more into LPL this year. So I can't stop watching anyone's legends. Uh, there's Ultra Prime that I don't know how they beat WBG. Uh, and they beat some better teams there too, right? Uh, there's LPL is so weird because there's like group A, B, D, or A, group A, B, C, and D. There's like a group of death that's unfair that has five teams in it when the other groups have four. But uh, it's very interesting to me because now I'm watching teams that I normally wouldn't watch last year that were like, let's see, the LPL is like 18 teams. LCK is like 10, right? So, uh, or 20, 18, 20, I forget. It, maybe it's lower now, but you used to only I used to only watch like the top five or six LPL teams around the the end of the playoffs, and this year I'm actually excited. And normally I don't put as much energy or effort. Actually, I put way too much time into all of this, but I don't put much value. Hey, it's pizza. Hey now, pizza. Good morning, or whatever time it is where you are, man. Uh, how are you doing, Pizza? Thank you for showing up. Yeah, I'm back at it, Pizza. I'm ready to start working again, buddy. I had to work on myself and do some uh, just working on myself, my mental, my physical, and I'm good. Yes, I'm going to try to actually do this stuff now, all right? Like, I had to get my life in order, and then I had to, like... Get a new place and change all of that and get into a routine and stuff. Uh, I haven't been playing so much because I've been watching so much gaming. I And I guess I need to do VOD reviews. Like, I have a notebook that's, I'm like a couple notebooks behind where I'm wanting to do G2 VOD reviews and I haven't had time because I wanted to talk about G2 and how, uh, like, they did an MSI and just looked bad at the end. Uh, but I, I didn't even get around to that. And then the new summer season started already. There's just so much going on. I'm having to learn that just to go at my own pace, because, like, I'm trying to watch all of this. Hey there, first time chat. Thanks for coming to the Sodoron stream. Now, Pizza and I and other people haven't really made a title for my stream yet. I always called it Soda Stream because there was this product out there called Soda Stream, and it kind of sounded cool. Except it was we were going to call ours Sodas Stream, but I don't know. I don't know. I'm I don't even know to play the game right now or do VOD reviews or what to do. But all I know is I gotta make content. If I sit here and do nothing every day, you guys are disappointed in me. So. I mean, hey, I did turn my stream on, and I have pizza show up. I've got a first-time chatter here. I've got at least two viewers, right? That's better than none, so at least I better get started and, and doing some streaming stuff. So what are, what are you up to, pizza? Are you like, hey, hey there, what is Red Ridge Chat? 
I got to learn how to read names very well because I know people will make some crazy names out there and they'll really get you to say some uh, probably vulgar stuff and try to make you look bad. So welcome to the Sodoron stream. Now, I don't know what I, I was just going to play a game of League of Legends right now because it's 1130 at night. And I was laying in bed and trying to sleep and can't. So it's like, let's get up. So hmm, what should I do? I've got a cold at the moment, so I'm just... Dude, I just went through two or three weeks of absolute hell where I went on... Um, I was on ADHD medicine, actually, Stratera. And I started on, like, 18 milligrams of it, and then I they increased me up to 25 milligrams of it. Right? So then the last month... It, we decided to try increasing it a little bit more, so we jumped it up to 40 milligrams. Well, I just went through a month of hell with this. And this Stratera, where I wake up every day and I'm just like sweating and cold, and then I want to take a shower, and then I take a shower, and I get out of the shower, and I'm hot, sweaty, and then I'm cold again. Yeah, it was awful. So, like, I just went through th like two or three weeks of that, and I can't eat, and it made me lose my appetite. And then, like, the whole time here, I'm wanting to play League of Legends and stream, and I can't because of my medicine. So, like, I've been trying to deal with my mental because I have a little bit of ADHD, and uh, it, it does seem to help me with gaming a little bit, I guess. But, um, yeah, that was pure awful. And then not to mention that, like, there was a horrible heat wave here where I lived last week, so... It felt like it was 100 degrees every day, and even at night it was about like 85 degrees. So like that was just awful. And then on the medicine I was taking, and it gives you hot flashes, and it makes you sweat, and just so I realized, and at least I realized, hey, this medicine's not working for me, so get rid of that and try a different one. So that's what I'm going through right now. So, you know, I'm just sharing... I like to share my horrible experiences with you all out there, right? Because we watch all these famous people out there, these streamers and pro gamers, and we just act and think their lives are so perfect, and they're really not. Hey now, Leon. Thank you for showing up, buddy. How have you been? Um, yeah, so... I don't know what I should do, guys. Like, really, I just popped on here for a minute. And I uh, thought, maybe I'll play a game of League of Legends. Maybe I'll start my stream up and see if anybody will show up. Uh, first off, can you guys hear me? Like, is my volume okay or, or not? You know, then I'm going to have to do the in-game setting tweak and, and, and all this. Volume is good? Okay. Yeah, I'm also talking very loud. Now, I used to worry about being in this red because you're clipping, right? Like, it probably makes it sound like... In your headphones that uh, it, it clips or it's staticky or something but um, I Howard Stern said when you're talking let it be in the red so I'm taking a little bit of his advice today so um, are you guys in chat are you playing League of Legends right now do you guys have any problems out there like in the game you're trying to figure out or you're stuck in a certain rank or role and you don't know what to do and you're trying to figure out are you guys out there just bored as hell right now so you don't know what to do and you're just watching some random streamer like me? Because like me, I can't, I have television, but I can't stand to watch it. Just playing casually. That's cool. Uh, that would, that would be fun to have that casual uh, thing like you because I'm so competitive that I'm not a fun friend, right? Like, I can't just play with my friends. I want to be the best, and so it causes a lot of problems. It would nice be nice just to be casual like that, and because the game should be fun. And that's a problem I've had with League of Legends, is it hasn't been fun for me the last... It has been, like, the last couple of years, but there for a while when I was playing, it wasn't fun because I've been playing it since 2012. So, I don't know. I guess taking a break will help. Um, but, and what really hooked me on League of Legends was the pro scene. Like, once I started, once I saw Taipei Assassins play in the, the Season 2 Championship, 
I, I got hooked on League. So, yeah, what I was trying is uh, I'm I'm a jungler, right? And like the one that I see that is OP right now that we don't see like at all on solo queue, at least in NA, that's all over LPL picks brand all the time. And he's been in LCK a little bit. He gets overpicked by like Nidalee, but um, the LPL value him more. And they have this weird draft over there. They're... Uh, What's it called? The something fear draft. Um, but I've been like messing with brand jungle. Now you guys have seen my content and stuff before. And what I'm happy about now with this practice tool that I noticed is they finally put what I've been complaining about in my content for two years in VODs is they made it so you can make the bots jungle and go to different, uh, lanes and stuff so like you've seen me mess around and practice tool well i like this even more now because i can just put the bot jungle right so i want to practice brand jungle and the diana so bam uh i got i trying to find out what runes really to use on brand the ones i the best ones i think i've seen so far is a dark harvest rune set but uh I was kind of going to experiment with Arcane Comet because I saw that uh, Canyon from Gen G does that. So, yeah, here we go. And thank you guys watching in chat. Um, maybe you can help me out here. We'll get the, the audio setting in my game. <laughs> it may be really off from the last time when I've streamed where the audio might be way too loud or something. So I'll try to maybe adjust that. I did get another problem fixed with uh, League of Legends 2 I was having with my mouse where it would change the sensitivity down all the time. That was bugging me. Where like every game I'd have to go into here. Well, never mind. But it don't do that now. Okay, so I, I like to just go to this practice tool here and I want to learn brand jungles. Or da -da -da. I try him on the blue side, so I mean I, I always try him on the red side right now, so I'll try him over here. Do -do -do. I gotta remember how to play this game. Okay. Fast forward another 30 seconds. So I wanna learn how to uh, play some brand jungle and before I go into a solo queue game and look like an idiot and have a horrible time. Like, I would rather go in this practice tool at least, like, maybe a couple times before I go into a solo queue game just to get the route down first instead of having a bunch of players and people yelling at me and tell me I suck. I think I messed that up. I think it... No, it's supposed to be cute. He has a tough time on the first clear. It's a little low health. And, uh... Supposedly right now, AP junglers are the strongest. Hopefully I can clear this without dying, right? I know he can do the red side. I haven't tried the blue side like this. He can clear over on this side without losing this much health. So, Diana Jungler is pushing a turret already. Um, let's see. Ah. I, w I wanted to get that Q stun in there on the big raptor and it didn't work. This is why we're trying it out on this first instead of the solo Q game. I guess what Brant, what really is good is that passive you see when it starts doing all that damage. Pretty crazy. Yeah. 
And so I could start talking about some jungle stuff right now, I guess. It's like, um, there's a timing where, what is it, like five minutes? Where you want to basically decide, do I get the void grubs or do I get the dragon? And maybe this looks really boring to you guys out there that we're doing nothing, but we're, we're learning our jungle route and clear before we go into a game with people. Which, trust me, it, it's a lot better than being irritated and having people tell you you suck and you're bad and you don't know what you're doing. When I mean, you don't know what you're doing when you just jump in a game like that anyways. Whoa, Diana. Now, the problem with me and the stuff I've been trying to do on my channel is I'm trying too hard, right? Like, I don't... All I gotta do is just play this game, and, and that's basically it. But I'm always thinking I gotta come up with this awesome content that people will watch. And I'm learning it's not really like that. You just play the game, and you get followers every day. So, I think the item I see the pro junglers take right here is this first. Hated Ashes. One of board. And uh, we're going to try these Void Grubs up here like I was talking about. Because this is what I would do in my game if I'm playing solo queue anyways. Is I'm going to do a clear and then I'm going to try to get either the Dragon or the Void Grubs around the five or six minute mark. I'm on a short fuse. But if you guys don't believe me, trust me, you'll probably be seeing a lot of brand jungle. I think I've seen the best junglers in the world do this thing too, where they like get all three of these to kind of group up here. So, something where you can get them to like And uh, I would, I, I'm all about taking the dragon, but I see like the best junglers and teams right now, like they seem to target the void grubs more. Um, but if you want to win, always, if you want to win, get the dragon every time. But the thing about the void grubs is they give you a lot of XP is the reason. So what I'm, what I'm trying to say there is like when I watch Canyon play solo queue from Gen G, right? He never tries to take the dragon in a solo queue game. Now that's not what you should be trying to do if you want to win. That's actually not what you do. But he's so good, like he's just kind of working on some other stuff. So like he would go for the void grubs first in a solo queue game. But like if you're watching T1 and a finals match and it's we this is our last series we have to win every game you would get the dragon first that xp wouldn't matter because you always want to get that elder dragon and the dragon soul okay so all of this was oh we'll, we'll go test this dragon out to see how quick we burn him down i guess brand's a really guy to Good guy to play if you're pissed off at the world and you just want to watch the world burn. Ooh. Oh, I'm going to get schooled by Diana. I just want to see how quickly I can do this. Man, that passive takes a lot of, does a lot of damage. Now, I only smited that there just because I wanted some extra mana. Uh, I wouldn't do that in an actual game. 
Yeah, he's... Yeah, he clears really strong. And then, like, the other really strong jungler right now is, uh, Nidalee. Which I'm decent with her. Why don't you try him in solo queue? I'm going to start playing him in solo queue. I just wanted to, uh... Yeah, I... Okay. Good call. Let's try it out. This is probably the only game I will play tonight, is this one game of Brand, but we will try it out, guys. Master Yakira. Rant. I always like to ban none just to get more practice. Did we play together our last game? Nope, just got on. Ugh. Right here, guys, like, this is what- I have to get over this. I get so bored in this draft thing on League. Like, it wastes so much time making a game. Because, and then we'll probably at least have to go through a couple more drafts just to get in a game. Oh, and did they... Wait a minute. They banned my pick. <laughs> what am I supposed to play now? No, I don't like TSM. I'm making fun of TSM with my name. Oh, man. I guess I could go Viego. Or I could dodge. Guess I'll go Viego, because I don't... I don't have Viego, I gotta buy him now. So, I've gotta... Sadly, I've never got good with Viego, so that's one I need to play. Sorry, I'll do Brand the next game. No, I don't like TSM. Uh, I've never been a fan of TSM. Um, Darian was this guy that was on Gambit. I don't know if you guys know Gambit or Moscow 5. He was their top laner. And so, <laughs> I was just kind of, <laughs> I was just kind of making fun of Darian because, and this was my Smurf name, and, uh, so I don't like TSM, and, uh, Darian was hilarious because on Gambit, he had this style where he would literally just go ham on somebody in top lane. And if he dies, he didn't care. He would just come right back and go just as ham and just keep doing that over and over. Even if he was like 0 and 10 and he would always play that way. So I figured I made this account and I was like, I'm going to play that way. I'm just going to play ham and just die over and over and not care and keep up that aggression. At least we got some uh, fast loads on this guy. Sometimes I've got into some of these really low ranked games here on League and it's been like a 10 minute load. I don't know who has a computer that slow in today's world. I, I, it's like they're on Windows XP. Okay, we've got Astronaut Vigar. Do I have a bad team, guys? Because I didn't pay attention. I've got uh, Eimerdinger, Misfortune. Level 9, level 32. I feel like I'm okay. I feel like my teammates will probably be okay. I should be the worst one on this team, right? So I am not a good Viego. I have played him in three week sometimes. Not too much, so this is a learning process for me. 
I mean, it's always a learning process, right? So I guess if I'm Viego, I want to try to farm on the red side over here and get red buff. Oh, I am. Uh, man, I left my earbud case in my room. <laughs> I guess my team doesn't want to follow and help stop an invade or something. I don't know why Warwick's down there. You know what? This game, we're not even going to care how well we do or what. We are just concerned about this clear... What are they doing wrong? Stand against me. Call me villain. Die. Last year I decided that okay, I'm gonna jungle. It's gonna be my main because I think this jungle pet is one of the most OP things they added. At least I got a little bit of a leash, right? So uh, I started playing a different style than what I was been playing, guys. I'm trying to play more like LCK pro gamer style here, and uh, I'll get more into that, obviously. It is such a small... But uh. I would try to gank a lot more, is what I'm trying to say, and I don't do that now. Like, I'm gonna farm hard like the the Chinese and Korean junglers. Alright. Yeah, there's no... They're not gonna win that fight. They're both level 2 and they're both level 1, and then they're gonna want me to all in. I guess you gotta get this in a straight line with this guy here, huh? I really like this champ. I think he's pretty cool, Viego. So I'm against, what is it again? Warwick. Alright. Now, I'm probably not at my best, like half asleep, tired, sleep drunk. We're not going caffeine on this. We're just being crazy. We're gonna win this in our sleep. Oh man, Jinx. If I was down there, I'd get a free kill, huh? that one. I guess, where's their top laner? I guess this is one of those games like I was saying on the load screen, guys, that I, I don't have anything to worry about, maybe. I got good laners in, on my team, because they're like level 32 in the masteries. Slayer! Yeah, let's get another sword, too. Alright. 
So guys, we want to do void grubs. I don't know how to read this. Response, I don't know did they get that one or I'm getting the void grubs. I'm not Is my wolf up? Yes. Okay. Oh, there's Warwick, haha. -ha. I should pro I would this would probably be a good chance to get the dragon because he's gonna come over here and try to fight me now. Four seconds. Alright. Because Warwick's gonna be like, oh man, I don't have any jungle. I don't know if I can take him or not. Yeah! I'm Warwick! I think I'm playing better, guys, so, like, if you just, like, chill with me and give me a chance, I know I've talked a lot of shit and I talk a lot of game, but, like, I think that, like, I might be able to climb this ladder this season. Maybe not. Oh, no. My set's not gonna help me, is he? He's going the wrong way. That and we'll get a ward. And we'll get that. Uh, I messed up on that right there. I made a play I didn't want to make. I should have backed off, paid for it, whatever. Oh, I got my ult now. But, uh, I'm doing this, like, Asian, Korean, Chinese farming harder style, I guess, than what I normally did when I played solo queue. Why would I want to be cautious? Alright, let's get the dragon. Yeah, I'm bad with Diego because I didn't know what to do in that situation. Oh well. What happened there? Our mid didn't come. Oh, I'm ahead of my set, man. I shouldn't be ahead of my set. I gotta get the next Void Grubs. I just noticed that... <laughs> I just noticed that Warwick was 5 and 1. Oh, oh man. Father Pit. He's dominating.
mean, there's not much I can do, guys. Like, aren't I a late game champion, Diego? Headed, yeah, I was gonna say, I. Oh. I guess the set doesn't realize that there's a Warwick here and a Darius. My team don't give a shit, so... That fight there, I went into that fight and I assumed that Set would be smart enough to see that Eimerdinger was here and come back down, but he didn't. He just went and pushed his turret, so... Again, I guess I should have backed off on there, but I saw a point to go in and try. Okay, so yeah, I guess I need plated steel caps on this game. Oh well, guys, I'm just a trash Viego. Not good enough to ever buy this champ. Your attack supply. being lazy with some of my mechanics here, like not paying attention to what my other laners have and items. Dragon and my team doesn't care to do anything to try to, to counter it, so there's nothing I can do. I was gonna try to go in and ult smite it.
I don't have any confidence in that set. Warwick's there. Sorry guys, I had to go to like try hard mode. with my uh, W. Oh yeah, I forgot I got it, I can, I can do this too. Yeah, Not cool. Oh, there's Viego. Trick me. This is the part I used to be lazy on. I'd get some kills in Golden Farm or whatever, and kind of stop. My my farming would fall off. So gotta keep it up the whole game. Oh, five. Warwick has 62, so I have double his. I'm not doing that well. Okay, I've got 2,600 gold to spend, guys. I definitely need that, and I don't remember what that next one to get is. I think that one. Right. I've even got the Rift Herald for me. That I don't know how to drive, guys. I don't know how to drive the Rift Herald. I've never done it. Uh, I don't know why I've been trying to help Pike. I think that's what my job is right here. Pop to it. <laughs> oh yeah, I have the Rift Herald, guys. I whipped my ult. I messed up. I don't know if we can kill them or not because I messed that up because I meant I I'll take the blame for that, guys. I messed up my ult there, so it was all my fault of why Misfortune didn't pay attention to help and why Pike died on his own. Yes, let's surrender. I mean, I guess I'm just a trash Viego, so it doesn't really matter. I did have the Rift Herald there. I'm to show him. Should go. 
bottom. I don't have any faith in this team. They don't know where to be, what objectives to take and play together. get we need uh morella nomicon and anti-healing items for warwick i whipped his ult on that too i don't know the i don't know the damage that viego's ult has very well so it's a learning curve for me Seems like a bunch of babies and they just want to give up. Team is lost, not gonna lie. I don't know how to drive these things. How do I eject? <laughs> I don't know how to drive it, I'm sorry. That was my first time trying that. Well, I did my job. See if my team can clean this up. I did my job. They really need the Morella Nomicon or something to anti-heal though. Oh look, the Rift Herald. Ugh. This is why I don't like to play games at midnight. I feel like my teammates are drunk or high. Or maybe, maybe I'm just a horrible Viego. Sterics. Gauge. Well, this is the point, I guess, where I have to start solo farming my own lane because my mid my AD doesn't know how to actually play AD because they should be in the mid lane right now being protected. I have to steal their farm. Sure, why not? Because these people are just wasting my time. Sorry, guys. I didn't win your game. We should have won. Yeah. Yeah, those people were... I don't know. I it just... Why get mad? Oh, B minus. That's not bad for a first time set. guys well I think that's my one I think I can maybe hopefully thanks for buying see you definitely need a Morella Nomicon executioners calling set needed an executioner calling right or not set somebody to go against Warwick maybe that's maybe I should have bought it I don't know no bramble vest Needed that for Warwick. That would have changed a lot right there just from his healing. But I don't know. It's look, you're not going to get good by winning one game. So you got to have the attitude that I have that 
I'm just here to learn and play more and more games and get better and better. It, one game, one one win or loss ain't gonna matter if I'm good or not. So if you got to sit here and justify why you won or lost, then you're not good, right? So anyways, see ya, Soder on stream. There is the... I don't know what to call today. I was going to say 4th of July, but I should stream again before 4th of July. There is the June 27th. It should have been 26th. I'll count this as 26th and not 27th, because I bet I'll be back later today. Because I'm finally feeling good to stream, guys. Like, I, I, Sorry I couldn't do it when you wanted me to and stuff, but I've getting my shit together so I can finally do this. Alright, so you should see me a lot this year and playing. I really like the meta in Pro League of Legends right now, so it's making me want to play and stream and watch the games. Um, I don't know if you like VOD reviews or whatever. I, I do need to do those. So, see you guys. Thanks for showing up. Please tell your friends about Sodoron to follow me at twitch.tv. I think it's Sodoron. I could be wrong. Or there's youtube.com slash at sign Sodoron5828. And my links are on there in my Twitch, Twitter, um, just look for Soderon. Thank you guys.